There's Boots chilling right there. <laughs> Being a kitty cat. He's giving me a very disgruntled look on his face. Because <laughs> he's posing for the camera now. Hi, Boots. All right, anyway. So, I'm working on a remix for my dudes in Pathkeeper, which is, I guess, I don't know what they'd like to classify themselves as. They're pretty heavy, though, so I guess they're more on the deathcore uh, side of metal. But um, this is like a, uh, I guess, like a fast kind of drum step, dubstep remix. And it's, it's kind of heavy. Um, I wrote this, I did this remix like a while ago. And um, I was going to release it when they were going to release their EP. And they're finally releasing it at the end of this month, which is May. So... I'm going to release it a week afterwards, but it's a cool little intro. I made a lot of these sounds with the virus. And I gave him some cool names, which is pot is brewing. <laughs> this far away devil calls. It's a very dragged out intro. So I took, I took their uh, guitars and I just put them in a melody and like chopped them up. And then just, I don't know, had some fun with it. Created my own melodies with an arty, melodic kind of part, I guess. It was more like the original is like a breakdown kind of part. And then uh, this part, there is, it changes up a little bit. All the vocals kind of come in right there. And then uh, there's like this little eerie lead that comes in. And then this build up's really cool because it changes tempos slowly. Okay. It just is so destructive when it just slows down that much. I love doing stuff like that. That's what the title track on my EP does. It's kind of something new I'm going for. Even though a lot of people, I've heard them slow down stuff. Like even Skrillex is a track in his new album where he slows down one of his tracks. Um, not insanely slows it down, but it's still like, it just has that power. And it's just really like heavy in it. It's definitely a lot of like, um, like metal influence that you can hear. And this was a metal remix, so I, I felt like there was a need to dr bring it down this slow. And then it's there's this part, or just like the riser, that goes into here. And it's this little vocal break. And it just goes into this part, which this is really cool. I took the the singing vocals from Adam, Adam Heiss, just a guitar player and singer, Pathkeeper. Looked that dude up. Um, I took his vocals and did some weird stuff with it, but it sounds pretty cool. But it, like rises into this.
It's like a cool little break. And then his vocals come in right there. took his vocals and made them sound like really deep and then really high at the same time and it doesn't sound like what he originally sounded like <laughs> And these little bells come in. This part was tricky because the tempo wasn't exactly on, so it's a little off, but. And there's like a delay that's like panning constantly. Can't see, it's right there. It's not in focus. Fucking dumb thing. There it is. And it just repeats that part, and then it goes right after this part, it goes right back to the beginning. So I kind of did like a reverse structure kind of thing. And then it just goes into that, and then uh, the ending. The ending is the same thing as the beginning. I love doing the structure because it's it's like you're slowly adding and then you're slowly taking away. But yeah, I'm releasing this in like, I wanna say like a month, something like that. I'm just doing some final touches on the mix. I'm not spending forever on it though because it's just a remix, but I, I think it's cleanly for the most part. It just needs to be mastered and, and whatnot. Cool story, man.